two series of uh, goals were to the Premier League, finishing Lincoln City in League One. Let's see if we can go from League One to the Premier League, back to back to back. But at the moment, we're standing at League One, choosing Lincoln City. So let's go. Hope you like the football, the video. If you like me to do these videos and continue on with the episodes, subscribe, like, and comment. Um, comment down what teams you go for in the Prem. And yeah, also I'm, I'm Matt Tajan on the call, so he's in the video. Go subscribe to his channel. But let's kick off with the video. Shop Asian. Um, Hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, we'll skip the previous invitation. Don't like doing that. I um, just want to get into this video. Um, Hey guys, hope you enjoyed this, this episode. Um, probably season one is hopefully to get to the championship. Season two will be all the championship. Season three will be the prem, and then yeah, caught in the blow for what we do. Lead two to lead to the prem, but uh, oh yeah. Um, yeah. So how, how are you guys going? So my dad is from Lincoln, he was born in England, so he's from Lincoln. So Lincoln is probably my, uh, my team I go for. I am a Man United fan, but that's, I'm too embarrassed to say that right now, but anyway, let's just move on. Kick off with episode one. And our first match is Lincoln City vs Hull City. Kick off with the video. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon. And you can really sense the anticipation in the crowd ahead of kickoff with their respective league seasons about to get underway. It's Lincoln City and they face Hull City. Well, thank you, Derek. Brilliant atmosphere here today. All that hard slog in pre-season. All aim for this game. First game of the season. All that preparation is for this. It's for this 90 minutes. Focus on it. Get the three points. Move on to the next one. Looking forward to it. takes on the shot yeah. and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save and a good tackle 
Well, a new era begins with a new manager in charge, and it's always interesting to see how that goes. One thing we can say without any fear of contradiction is that you don't get an awful lot of time in football nowadays. No, you don't, Derek, that's for sure. And it will take a little time for his ideas to get over to the players. I'm sure he's got big plans for this team, and it all starts here today. Chances on. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, well, we can now go to Alan McAnally for news of a goal elsewhere. Alan? It's a goal for Charlton Athletic. 12 minutes played, 1-0. Might be a chance here. No, I have two chances and I miss. Opportunity in the wide area. Over the touchline for a throw-in. And players waiting in the centre. Well, no problems defensively. Well, real excitement here. I say that because it is his long-awaited debut coming up. What should we be looking for from him, Lee? Well, Derek, they've had problems in that area in recent years. So I think... And there Come it on. is! 1-0! The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back. But I have to say, after that, the keeper doesn't cover himself in glory. Near post, left exposed, and he's punished. Let's go, guys. 1 0 then. Goal for the hosts, number nine, Tom Hopper. Alert defending. And that's an important intervention in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. He takes aim, but it wasn't a taxing save. Sorry, guys. Two goals, well done. Honeyman. And the referee oh, felt he had card, to blow the whistle. He's been admonished by the referee. He's well, thank you, Rick. No card for me. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? And he might be through here. Well, if only oh, he had timed us run slightly better. Offside. Well, someone has found the net in one of the other games. Here's Alan McAnally to tell us more. It's a goal for MK Dons. 25 minutes played, 1-0. Many thanks, Alan. Using all his defensive acumen to yeah, cut it out. Is, can he put it in? Well, that looked to be quite dangerous, but just oh, a oh, fraction sorry. off. And the poor touch didn't help them on the possession front. Hopper, dangerous looking attack, Grant, just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did, it'll be a corner, well news coming through of a penalty, Alan McAnally can fill us in, it's a penalty for Northampton Town, up steps Chris Lines, a slight delay as the ref clears the defenders, and he's made headway, can he convert? That is top-notch goalkeeping. He had to reach in with his hand. Yeah, it's all about reading the pace of the ball and the player's feet. When do I go down? When do I strip the ball? Did a brilliant job. Can they square the game? Simple save, really. Liam Bridcut. Grant. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. It 
might be on for them. Can he put it away? Well, the shot more than decent. It had power, just couldn't find the oh, target. A goal has been scored in one of the other games. Alan McAnally has the news. It's a second goal for Charlton Athletic. 37 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. James Jones. Not showing good patience. Chance to finish. Well, credit to him for trying it. Oh, Didn't miss come by on, much. boys. Anderson. And then with a real chance. Can he find the net? Well, they can say a big thank you oh, to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. And nicely struck. Well kept out. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Not a good pass. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Not the best challenge. Free kick. Oh, for God's sake, man. Malik Wilkes. And fed back to the goalkeeper. Liam Britcutt. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. Oh, come, it is half time here. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Alan McAnally. It's the second goal for Ipswich Town. 48 minutes played, 2-1. Thank And he might be through here. And it's gone in. The team's separated Come on. by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here it is again. You're trained from a young age to get in those sort of positions. And never in any real doubt he'd finish that. Cool and composed. So, 2-0 now. Looks promising this. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. And we're focusing on him for a reason. He's playing with real authority and attack late. Yeah, Derek, all those hours on the practice pitch pay off time and time again for this lad. It's not look, you know, why he's in the right place at the right time. He's driven in the corner. Well, he was being pursued Sorry, furiously. <laughs> the effort, though, nothing to write home about, really. No, I think you give the credit to the defender there. Just put him off balance. The hosts have really controlled possession. And what that does, it just relaxes the team. If you've got the ball, you enjoy the ball. And they're turning it into goals as well. Well, many a fan has been wondering about this. It is now official. Chiro Immobile has completed his move to Bayern. Well, he's in here. The net is staring him in the face. Oh. The shot from that position left a bit to be desired. You just got to hit the target. Let the power down a little bit and go for accuracy. Oh. 
Smallwood on the ball. Untidy in possession. I'm hearing that there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Who is it for, Alan McAnally? It's a goal for Rackington Stanley. 60 minutes played, 1-1. Many thanks, Alan. Promising sequence. And they have possession again. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Crossing possibilities. Well, the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Played into the centre of the box. The outcome is a goal kick here. Well, you know, I don't think the goalkeeper will be the slightest bit bothered by that effort. Well, he won't want to watch that on the replay, I tell you. He was way, way wide there. In with a chance. It's got to be. Oh. It goes begging Lee. That could have been the ticket back into the game. Well, two goals down. You can't keep wasting chances like this. A goal has been scored in one of the other games. Alan McAnally has the news. It's a third goal for Charlton Athletic. 66 minutes played, 3 0. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. A fine reading of the situation. Wilkes. He's going forward well here. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Oh, is he going to be punished here? Oh, God. Might be dangerous. Oh, oh how did he get that in? Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Oh, man. How did he get that in? No, to be fair, well, here's the goal to again, fair, that's a really good goal. Napping, yeah, how did he get that finished, in? Rightly punished, schoolboy stuff. Far man. Albeit from a different angle. Oh, no. That, yeah, that's good. Well done. Well, two one it is here. Jackson. The high press was very much on. Can they square the game? Still a chance. Can he convert? And able to get a body in the way. Well, he's hit it with far too much height. Well, he's quite a long way out, and if you put power on the ball and just lean back slightly, it's going to rise, and that time, over the bar. Possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Well, there's been a goal elsewhere. Alan McAnally with the latest. It's a second goal for Rochdale. Ten minutes remain. <sighs> Thanks, Alan. Now still pressing for a goal here. And after Good that defending, boys. Good effort, defending. It's gone out for a throw-in. Now he must favour the cross. A really vital interception. James Jones. 
Oh, the pass not finding its target. A chance maybe from the wide position. Opportunity it is. And he did his job defensively. Well, that was a guilt-edged opportunity for the equaliser. Well, you always hope for one more chance in a game. And that was it. The chance for an equaliser. Couldn't keep it. And news coming through of a goal on the Peterborough game. Alan McInally can tell us more. It's the second goal for AFC Wimbledon. Four minutes remain. 2-2. Two -two. Thank you, Alan McInally. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Good pressure high up the pitch. <laughs> the electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Oh. Well, last gasp defending. Oh, it's a penalty. For what, man? For what? Come on. Stage two, oh, you're in the ball. Oh, you're in the ball. Penalty given and yellow card handed out. terrible chance to let go there's a good reason why I haven't been there Lee <laughs> oh goalkeeper blunder oh surely oh, oh no hell Hell, man, this is bullshit. Hell. Well, Derek, as we see it again, Why it's not? a big mistake. You try to teach youngsters not to get caught in possession Fucking and be aware hell, of what's around you. He has no clue, and he pays the price. Fuck. Goals are plenty. Two, I was reading two. two. I was reading two one, and they scored two goals. We have entered the final minute of normal time. Fuck! So the can't final do that. whistle and the end of an evenly fought contest. But Lee focusing on the hosts. What about their performance? Got, no, man. Yeah, a few of the players are still easing Fuck. their way back Rigged. in. You feel a few tired legs out there towards the end. That's for sure. Uh -huh. Not a bad result though, and it's just important they build on that now for the next game. Well, guys, the first game is a draw. Stupid mistake by me, but how did I score a second one, man? Fuck. And he takes on the shot. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Oh, my hell, man.
you know, diamond turn against Judy's brain. Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. Derek Ray here in the commentary well, position. I mean, no. I'm joined as always by Lee Dixon. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Shrewsbury Town and they face Lincoln City. Yeah, thank you Derek. Looking forward to today. She'll be in for a good game. Let's hope we see a quick start from both teams. Set the tempo for the rest of the match. James Jones in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. An attack full of promise. Must take the lead here. A routine no. save. Come on, boy. And news of a goal on the Hull City game coming through. Alan McAnally can fill us in. It's a goal for Hull City. Seven minutes played, 1-0. Cheers again, Alan. Hopper. Anderson. Grant. James Jones. A cut back. And couldn't stay onside. That's a pity. Oh, no, man. Edwards, the referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. And the referee sees on, that as a the foul, ball. Come free on. kick given. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, I just told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Vela, well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. Chance to finish! Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Britka. Anderson. Hopper. Oh, in with a chance. Gives it a go. Come on. Well, in this replay, you're going to oh, see sure. a 2v1 against the keeper. How does that happen? He'll be asking his defence why he was left exposed. Paris. Nothing he could do. He comes to him where he didn't arrive. All for the visitors, number eight, James Jones. Let's get an update from Alan McAnally. There's been a goal in the Charlton match. Alan. It's a goal for Rochdale. 18 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Jackson, there to take it away. Come on, man. Bread cut. And the keeper with the ball. James Jones, Jackson, Bridka, Anderson, Hopper. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Can the owner of the red Grant, registration James Jones, and it might be. Well, hey. 
Well, they're going to be very cross oh, with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Man. Oh, that's a good the referee correctly decided to play advantage. Careless in possession. Grant. Hopper. Anderson. And he read it well defensively. Oh, no, man. And on the back of that particular challenge, Come on. the referee let the matter rest there. No, the no. referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. in the center wonderful block well goal kick just as it was looking promising oh big chance oh he's missed it oh a goal behind Derek and he's missed it's a big miss yeah And news of a goal in one of the other matches. Over to Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Northampton Town. 34 minutes played. 1 0. Many thanks, Alan. And take no, it away. No Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Well, it could be on for him here. Chance, maybe. Well, it was never going to worry hey. the keeper. Well, no wonder he's looking a little bit sheepishly at his teammates. Head in a hand sort of moment. Bread cut. Hopper. Anderson. Grant. What? James no, no, no. Jones. Fruitful looking attack. And a goal kick will be next. Well, how about this for a big transfer story? Pierre Emerick Aubameyang has completed his move to Real Madrid. Well, Derek, an estimated fee of around eighty-five million pounds. Huge amount of money. I think you're going to get a good player, though. I think you're going to get a player that really fits into your club. Will he produce? Well, we'll have to wait and see. Well, look at those stats, Derek. The host dominating possession over the last 15 minutes. They just need a bit of magic or a bit of luck. They will take either, I'm sure, at this stage to get back into this game. It's opening up for them. <laughs> well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. Really good high press. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Well, a corner kick it is. What can they do with this one as they look for inspiration? And a decent delivery. Got to it easily, the keeper. That is that for the first half here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. I'm trying. 
The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Jackson. James Jones. Grant. I'm hearing there's been a goal on the Charlton game. Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Charlton Athletic. 47 no. minutes played. 2-1. Thanks very much as always, Alan. James Jones. Hopper. Liam Bridcut. Patient build up at the moment. Grant. And he takes it on. Well, body in the way. Not too okay, fussy in man. clearing his lines. Will he find the net? It looks promising. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. <laughs> hey. I'm hearing that there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Who is it for, Alan McAnally? It's a second goal for Blackpool. 57 minutes played. 2 0. Cheers again, Alan. They couldn't keep possession. Free kick oh, awarded come on, there man. by the referee. What? No, no, no. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Difficult to stop him. And it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. As you can see, the visitors don't have too much of the ball. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Oh, big chance! Oh, he's missed it! Oh, goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. Not really what you want to see from your keeper. Edwards. And a goal has gone in at the KCOM Stadium. Alan McAnally. Well, it's a third goal for Hull City. Mm. 68 minutes played. 3-2. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. A really intense pressure applied. Targets available. Cross comes in. Big chance to get them on terms. Can that is top-notch goalkeeping. He had to reach in with his hand. Yeah, it's all about reading the pace of the ball and the player's feet. When do I go down? When do I strip the ball? Did a brilliant job then. Jackson. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Going well. It's there for him. It looked as though he almost forced the shot yeah. that time. Well, it's okay shooting from there, but you have to test the keeper. It rules my chain. Well, we can now go to Alan McAnally for news of a goal elsewhere. Alan? It's a goal for AFC Wimbledon. Yeah. 75 minutes played. 2-1. Alan McAnally with his finger on the pulse. Well, their hopes rise as they win a corner. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Yeah. So the corner played into the box. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Oh, no! And you have to feel for him now. 
It will go down as a I'm giving it on goal. goal. Well, let's see that again. I don't want to look at it as a former defender. I've scored a few of these in my time. And they were always my fault. Got blamed for all of them. Important the players pick him up from here on in. <laughs> oh, come on. Well, the earlier oh, goal cancelled out. One apiece. Yeah, you got, you got your meeting. I won't see you next year. You're doing a different course. Well, let's get details of a goal that's been scored in one of the other games. Yeah, but Alan different course, and we get different lunch cards. Yes, we will. Many thanks, Alan. The Lidgesy Mass. The same as me. That's what I just said. Yeah, I'm doing Lidgesy and Numacy, so Great we'll do job. that one. The way of a Gen U is. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. Bridcut. Yeah, but our lunch time will be different. James Jones. On the attack. Is there to be late drama? Jones. Many Anderson. He's given it straight to the opposition. Pierre. As far as stoppage well, time I'm is concerned, one. three minutes here. No, no, that's all together. It's one. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. James Jones. Another draw, boys. Well, they weren't to be separated in the end. It goes into the books as a draw. Lee, what did you make of it? Well, Derek, goals, excitement, mistakes, heroics. What more could you ask for in a game? Maybe a winner. Good game, though, wasn't it? Oh, wow. Well. Oh, let me see. Mm. Oh, I'm calling one. Yeah, welcome to boarding.
Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm doing way I'm doing way out here. That's what I want to do after the time. Way out here. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Probably Every wherever to believe can you take to be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Lincoln City. Oh no, you, you work in the shed. Oh well. Yeah, the talking is over. The game plans are set. Now it's up to the players to go out and earn their corn. There's nothing <laughs> the managers take. can do once the first whistle goes. I think, Derek, we're in for a cracker. Good bit of pressing. Well, he's allowed his opponent to get past him. He's going to be oh, angry with himself, Lee, having failed to take that chance so early in the game. Well, the first chance of a game's important, but the first goal, sometimes it comes, you're not expecting it. Gary Roberts is with Garner. Lee Evans. But he's got past his man. Chances on. Well, that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he's had an absolute nightmare there. The goal's in front of him. Just hit it. No. Grant. Hopper. Anderson. Can they get in behind them? He takes aim. Excellent block. Oh, oh my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal oh, of the goal. highest class! Fantastic technique! Yeah. Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when it comes to him, he chooses early to volley it. What a finish. Ole, ole. Ole, well, let's ole. take another look at that goal, shall we? The opening goal of the game, then. Goal for the hosts, number nine. Yeah. Yeah, we have two ping pong tables, a pool table, a canteen. Jackson. Oh, I'm on it. Oh, yeah, so. Um, yeah. James Jones. Jackson, Liam Bridcut, James Jones, Grant, Anderson, superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Now, well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Anderson. Grant. No, He's there for him. And fails yeah, to keep himself that. onside, unfortunately. <sighs> Anderson giving it a try well the shot more than decent it had power just couldn't find the target <laughs> and 
and winning it back. Moving it forward. And the referee spotted the... He's in with a chance. Is it going to be? And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Grant. Hopper. James Jones. Unable well, to keep the ball. You can have McCoy doing tight. Chris is doing tight. Joe Garner. And in with a real chance. Promising attack, but his timing was off. I'm hearing that there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Who's it for, Alan McAnally? It's a goal for Hull City. 30 minutes played, 1-0. Many thanks, Alan. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Oh. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Opportunity it is. And a goal. Oh, the oh. Superb entertainment. Oh, man. What's the goalkeeper doing? Well, let's look at this again. Magical football on the break. Surprise is the key. And when he Link, gets through Lincoln to the City. keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. Well, boys, Lovely the very two Premier League is on. He could shit so, two doors at the moment. Could this be, be drawn number three? Well, let's get details of a goal that's been scored in one of the other games from Alan McInerney. This is League One. I'm trying to get the Prem. 35 minutes, please. 1-0. Thanks very much, yeah. as always, Alan. You can look at the title. Uh -huh. yeah. Red cut. James Jones. A fine use of the ball. Anderson. Liam Bridcut. An attack full of promise. Well, they did have possession of the ball, but all that good work now counts for nothing. Palmer. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Oh, the for what now, man? Let that go. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think, and the referee's making that absolutely clear. <laughs> well, I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. Gary Roberts. Not the pass he had in mind. Grant, it's opening up for them. Chances on. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. <laughs> it was offside anyway. Fuck. It was offside anyway. Opportunity in the wide area. No possibilities inside the box. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Is this the moment? Oh. Whatever way you look at that, it's been yeah, hello, hey, John. Jackson. And with that, the first half draws to a close. He's been the... Yeah. Into the second half, then. <laughs> and these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. No. Cameron. <laughs> oh, he's given the ball away. And news of a goal in the Blackpool match. Let's hear about it from Allen. It's a goal for Charlton Athletic. 46 minutes played. 1-0. 
1-0. Cheers again, Alan. Jackson. Liam Britka. James Jones. Barcelona have been very busy on the transfer front. The contract situation ironed out. And he could be available very soonly. Well, for a fee of around 120 million, you'd expect to be a good addition to any squad. Make no mistake, this lad will be that. He's a very good footballer. So about the guys, my headset died. Um, let's try it now. James Jones, Anderson, there to take it away. I thought this was like an English League Cup. That's why I didn't want to do this game. I think it's not too long. Not a good that long to press. Yes, the play was lead one. Just needs to keep a cool head. Yeah, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? And firing it into the area. It comes to absolutely nothing. Real danger. Well, they know they need to stop him. Courageous goalkeeping, but he's got the ball. Well, you have to be brave, don't you? Diving at the feet of a player like that. Good goalkeeping. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, unable to bend his run. Oh, come on, man. Joe Garner. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Hopper. Anderson. Far from a good pass. The no, outcome is a goal kick. kick here. Um. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. James Jones. Anderson. And moving the ball nicely. a pass that lacks quality well that was good until pressing high to win the ball asking a lot to score from there goalkeeper's ball so guys, every thursday of uploading well, Derek, just look at those stats not created enough maybe chances maybe they really haven't they every need to Sunday, the Monday, put the pressure on then they should win this game don't know yet but yeah gary roberts yeah give this video a like if you want to continue with the series, to to subscribe if you want, if you like it. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Takes aim! Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. Jackson. Liam Bridcut deciding to give it to the keeper. Well, we can now go to Alan McAnally for news of a goal elsewhere. Alan, it's a goal for Fleetwood Town. Eight minutes remain. 1 1. Regular updates from. Can he put them in front? <laughs> and they'll get ready for the throw in. And time for the change now.
Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. I'm not afraid to have another light track, another light change. Here it is now, a substitution. Uh -huh. Could face difficulties here. Can he finish? This is why we adore oh this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no, there's another chance, and there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, here's the goal again, and he's just God, been caught in the corner. Hell, man, he's man. Picked, punished, schoolboy stuff. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. James Jones. Walsh. Jones. Read it well. And only two minutes remaining here. Now can they make something happen? Yeah. The inside route looking promising. And he read it well, intercepting it. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Hopper. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. It was yeah. a fight, and that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Meet cool. your thoughts. Well, it was such a tight affair for most of the game. And, and to it. lose... 2-1. So, guys, we're two draws and one loss to start the season. A good way to start the episode. Yes. No, I have to win. Late one. So that is today's video for you today guys, we're seeing in 21st, no good way to start the episode, but I'll see you probably Monday or Tuesday or Sunday. If you like the video, give it a like, subscribe, like, comment, go subscribe to our four stitch account, go subscribe to Page and Corey, and I'll see you in my next video, till then, you know what it is, don't go missing, catch ya.